A black dwarf will be the final fate of those last stars. White dwarfs that have become so cold that they barely emit any more heat or light. Black dwarfs are dark, dense, decaying balls of degenerate matter. Little more than the ashes of stars. Their constituent atoms are so severely crushed that black dwarves are a million times denser than our sun. Stars take so long to reach this point that after nearly 14 billion years, we believe there are currently no black dwarves in the universe. But despite never seeing one, we can still predict how they will end their days. Just as the iron that makes up this ship will eventually rust and be carried away by the desert winds, so we think that the matter inside black dwarves, the last matter in the universe, will eventually evaporate away and be carried off into the void as radiation, leaving absolutely nothing behind. With the black dwarves gone, there won't be a single atom of matter left. All that will remain of our once rich cosmos will be particles of light and black holes. After an unimaginable length of time, even the black holes will have evaporated and the universe will be nothing but a sea of photons gradually tending towards the same temperature as the expansion of the universe cools them towards absolute zero. And when I say unimaginable period of time, I really mean it. It's 10,000 trillion, 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 trillion years. How big is that number? Well, if I were to start counting with a single atom representing one year, then there wouldn't be enough atoms in the entire universe to get anywhere near that number. Once the very last remnants of the very last stars have finally decayed away to nothing and everything reaches the same temperature, the story of the universe finally comes to an end. For the first time in its life, the universe will be permanent and unchanging. Entropy finally stops increasing because the cosmos cannot get any more disordered. Nothing happens and it keeps not happening forever. It's what's known as the heat death of the universe, an era when the cosmos will remain vast and cold and desolate for the rest of time. And that's because there is no difference between the past, the present and the future. There's no way of measuring the passage of time because nothing in the cosmos changes. The arrow of time has simply ceased to exist. Thank you.